Nextcloud has become my go-to on-premise cloud solution. It's a drop-in replacement for Google services and does an outstanding job of integrating with most platforms. And with the release of the latest iteration of the desktop client, users can take advantage of end-to-end -end encryption and a new interface that brings Nextcloud Hub closer to the desktop. For most platforms, it's incredibly easy to install the desktop client. On both Windows and Mac OS, it's just a matter of downloading and running the installer file. Once installed, you can then log into your Nextcloud instance and not only enjoy that desktop to server integration, but sync your files and folders to your machine. On Linux, however, the installation is a bit trickier. Let me show you how this is done. The first thing you must do is integrate your desktop to your server. This is done via your desktop settings. For instance, in GNOME, it's through online accounts. Click the next cloud entry and fill out the necessary information for your server and account. Once you've taken care of the integration, download the Nextcloud desktop client app image for Linux. Once the file is downloaded, right-click the file and click Properties. In the resulting window, click the checkbox for Allow Executing File as Program. Close the Properties window and then double-click the app image to launch the desktop client. When prompted, click Login. In the resulting window, type your Nextcloud server address and then walk through the browser prompts to connect the Nextcloud server to the client. You'll finally be asked to grant permissions for the client, and the Desktop App Sync Configuration window will open where you can configure your options. Once the Desktop App opens, make sure to open the Settings window, click the General tab, and check the box for Launch on System Startup. Otherwise, you'll have to manually start the Desktop Client every time. And that's how you install the newly released Nextcloud Desktop Client on Linux. Once you've taken care of this, Working with your next cloud account from any platform is a breeze. If you want to learn more in the ways of everything tech, be sure to subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and watch more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.